Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how you can add your Parallelable Analytics to your WordPress site from your self-hosted environment. So first you need to log into your Plausible dashboard and you need to add a website. And you're going to name it plausible.webnestify.cloud but you may vary. You may enter your website URL. You will select your time zone. You're going to add snippet. And you can disregard your snippet. You just click start collecting data. After you see this page, you go to your WordPress. As you can see, this is a blank WordPress with no plugins, only Lightspeed is installed. And you want to add a new plugin. A new search for plausible. You install the plugin and activate the plugin. And now we have our Plausible Analytics plugin. To edit the standard configuration, you need to go to the tools, uh, to the settings, and you see Plausible Analytics. On the second tab, self hosted, you need to enter your analytics uh, URL without HTTPS. So in my case, it was analytics cloud. you enable and you save changes and you go back to general. And now when we enter our self-hosted URL, you just need to go to your main menu. You click this wheel settings, you go to visibility and uh, if you want to have your stats in your WordPress dashboard, you need to create a shared link. You create a link, you name it plausible. You can enter password if you want, but in this case, I'm not going to enter password and you create a shared link. You copy this link. You go back to your WordPress and here with your stats in your WordPress dashboard, you will enter the URL and you enable that and save changes. And now you need to clear the cache and we're gonna open incognito window let me share it so now we have our incognito window and if you want to check if you have your analytics snippet already installed, you need to inspect the page. You enter the URL of your analytics. You can go to network. And as you can see, we have our plausible analytics script from our own subdomain. And uh, when we go back to check the stats, We already see that we have our visitor. In this case, it was me. And when you go to your WordPress, you go to dashboard and analytics. And you will see that you have your analytics dashboard right here. If you didn't have your own plausible instance, you can check this comprehensive guide that will guide you step by step how you can create your own analytics server. And we'll link it down in description and if you if you have any issues let me know down in the comment below also subscribe to my channel for more plausible analytics tutorials cloudflare tutorials run cloud tutorials etc so yeah thank you for watching and stay tuned